Hey cut friends, so honestly this is a very impromptu video but I'm getting ready to prep my hair for a protective style and I thought I would share it with y'all. So I'm going to get my hair braided in the morning. So I'm going to co-wash um, and do my deep conditioning treatment. So I'm gonna co-wash with my Diva Curl No Poo. I usually always full on wash day before a protective style, but I did that, today is Thursday, so I did that Saturday because my hair appointment was supposed to be on Sunday and it ended up being rescheduled. So I am i don't want to, I've been just wearing my hair in twists with just leave-in. I haven't been manipulating it a whole lot because I knew it would go through a lot <laughs> for this appointment. So I haven't been messing with it, bothering it. So I just took the twist out. I'm just gonna co-wash, do a deep conditioning and then I'm gonna blow dry. Luckily I hadn't blow dry blow dried it when I found out that um, it will be rescheduled because I don't like to blow dry it twice or put too much heat on it within a week's time. So stay tuned. <laughs> open sleigh jingle bells jingle bells jingle all the way oh what fun it is to ride in the one horse open sleigh dashing through the snow in the one horse open sleigh over the fields we go laughing all the way bells on bobtails ring making spirits bright what fun it is to laugh and sing a sleighing song tonight Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh So I'm all done. Now to get it braided. I like to trim my ends. Well, I'm not gonna say I like to trim my ends. I like to have my ends trimmed. This is my first time doing it myself. I basically followed a video from Tresses of Alexis when she trimmed her ends, when she literally said, don't do this at home. This is just something I'm trying and what I do. I did it, but it like it worked out. I really do not want to get braids on top of those old ends. I didn't cut a whole lot, obviously. It's just a trim. Let's see if I can't show y'all. Let me see. It's all here I put. So yep. Yeah. Now to see Mimi, so quick rundown. I don't think I have to co-wash up here though, but that's okay. Oh yes, I do. I just used this to co-wash. This is the Diva Curl No Poo. As you can see, you're not gonna get a whole lot of lather with this, but my hair was cleansed and my scalp felt clean and, clean and that's all I wanted. So I used that. I don't know when I got that or how old it is. Don't judge me again from Tress of Alexis. Hashtag use your stash. I'm trying to use stuff up. And then I always go in with a heat protectant. This is by Avita. This is the Damage Remedy Daily Hair Repair. And nothing daily for my hair. Um, it says it's instant visible repair and protect from heat styling. I don't care anything else about the protect from heat styling. Again, I got this in the curl kit, I believe. I don't know when, I don't know how long, I don't know how old it is, but I just finished up another heat protectant I was using and I moved on to this because again, 
Hashtag use your stash. So that's it for this video, y'all. Oh, and then, of course, I went in with my um, homemade-ish DIY. I got that recipe from Sheree Del Sol. Uh, I'll try to link the video below, and then I just added my own little razzle-dazzle to it, and you can too. Um, I will be posting how I make mine, and then I will... I'm always going to give credit to where credit is due, so I'll link her video in that video as well, but going to get this hair protected. Y'all have a good day. Peace out, girlfriends.